Hello again. We are now examining the sonar capability of LK8000. Uh, first of all, sonar is about giving you a sound information about how close you are to an airspace. And uh, this is totally automatic and can be disabled anytime. Sonar is working all over the program automatically and uh, it doesn't matter where where are you in inside any kind of pages if you are on, on multimap one if you are on any textual page or if you are in radar page so let's let's start flying we are in simulator right now so what i do is i give some altitude So bring altitude up to some thousand meters and then I start flying and as you see we have an airspace in front of us. Um, let's have a look at the airspace from Multimap 4. Here we are. Now we just four four kilometers out and you can see that multimap page four is automatically rescaling entirely it's called auto zooming because it zoom in to let you have a perfect view of nearby airspace so we are four kilometers away and unfortunately we're just right in the middle of a or, or vertical altitude so we will end up exactly falling in the middle of the airspace of Lugano which is in Switzerland and we are going at 142 kilometers. LK8000 is estimating uh, by using the speed uh, how fast you will be approaching to the airspace. And uh, we are giving out warnings depending on time in advance based on the speed. Which means that if you are fast, we are going to predict you are going to be there faster than if you are going slower. And uh, at a certain point, when you are, let's say, thousand, ki uh, thousand meters away, you will start listening to a, a low and slow um, bing, which is typical of sonar. And um, then as far as you get closer to the airspace, this sound is getting more and more frequent. At the point that you will be able to understand that you are about 100 meters away. So let's wait for that. We're just closing now. And you can listen to the sound yourself. We are in. So now we go out of it and we still get the sonar. So even if you get out of the airspace and you're, you're nearby, you still get the sonar sound. Here it is. Let's zoom in a little bit so you can see how close we are. So if we're going straight near to the airspace, let's go page 4. You see, we are seeing the glider, which is just, we are in the back. And we keep 300 meters away. So we can really get very close to the airspace without looking at the map itself. If you don't like this, you can go to info and then the sonar is here. Sonar is disabled, no more sonar. Sonar is enabled, sonar is back working. That's it, this is the sonar. It's very, it's very easy to use it 
and by default it's always activated. There's no configuration for that and it's not saved. What you can do is just do this. And if you don't like it, you disable it. It won't bother you again until the next time you start up LK. Thanks for listening for this explanation about the sonar.